listening sounds insane. It's probably the loudest bike I've ever heard, honestly. Welcome back to the channel guys. Today is so special for me and my brother because we got to own one of the dream bikes that we always wanted. It is an RSV4 Aprilia. This is a 2014 and this one is already tuned. It's got a full exhaust. It's got one down sprocket and then one up uh, rear sprocket. So better off the launch. It's got the quick shifter. It's got the GP shifter. So one up one up and then the rest down so that's that's pretty cool it's got the asb levers just got a couple of little add-ons to make the bike even more fun and it's got this nice exhaust this thing is, sounds so crazy when you're when you're uh, riding and stuff it does have the uh block off plates so it doesn't shoot flames so maybe just maybe might have to take that off and it's uh it's just oh my god man it just sounds crazy i know you guys are going to want to hear this it's got upgraded uh brakes also so we got to turn this thing on and i know you guys are gonna love the sound of this thing it's so rowdy it's 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 just intense here we're gonna turn it on real quick big fan of red but you know what this red on this bike is just like catching my attention so bad it like it really stands out it, i have a bunch of aftermarket parts still in the garage there's a carbon fiber body for for the for the frame there's just a bunch of stuff that we're gonna add and then we'll do some wrap on this thing like it needs needs some touches so that's coming on the next video It's not even, that's not even anywhere near 10,000. This is 5,000 RPM. Oh my God, guys. Um, I have to turn it off because my neighbors are going to hate me. This is, it was a bad idea parking it out here and revving it. I'm going to have to go somewhere else just because I'm really cool with my neighbors. Dude, it just sounds brutal. Like it's, doesn't the r1 sounds different than this bike like a lot of people like the way the r1 sounds this one just sounds more rough i don't know if it's also because this exhaust uh it's i think it's the exhaust was from the uk right or something like that i think my brother found it in the uk uh so the trim pieces that i have that are carbon fibers they're for the rear subframe uh or for the arm sorry for the rear arm and i have the carbon fiber for the frame over here so i'm gonna put that on i'm gonna do some designs with the wrap on the next video i'm gonna take this one probably for a spin real quick for the video and then just show you guys what it's like to ride a 2014 one of the most brutal bikes i've ever got to experience uh, it feels very stiff it feels very nice i'm um, the guy who had it before i guess he took pretty good care of it uh he some just this plastic over here seems a little loose but that's about it uh, other than that i mean i really like the bike so and it just looks so aggressive from this rear end. This rear end angle just looks fucking insane, dude. It feels good how your knees fit next to the gas tank. Like it has that, that, that figure for your legs to get in there. She feels comfortable. I've got to go take it for a ride now. So let's enjoy some footage. Enjoy the sound of this thing. And uh, stay tuned for the next video once we upgrade some stuff on it. Um, I'm sure you guys are going to like the way it looks. So. Oh my god. This thing just sounds crazy. It's just backfiring. It's backfiring like crazy, bro. Get it, guys. Whee! 
Let's go. Oh my god, can you pick up that freaking sounder? Alright, we're gonna try out the bike in the canyon. See how it see how it does. Cause uh, I haven't tried it out. I don't know how good it feels like. But <laughs> it's backfiring like crazy. And this it's got the uh, book I've played, so you can't really... It's not going to shoot flames, unless you probably do give it a good. Alright, we are pretty much in the start of the canyon. It's, uh, this canyon is obviously really, really hard to ride on, because it has some really bad twisties, but we're going to try it out. to this bike so we're gonna see how it does I do feel like I need to connect with the bike more and I feel like I have to lean forward like a lot more than the other bikes oh shit. I jumped on that one how are you But the braking on this bike is really good. I was told that he upgraded the brakes to a newer 2018 Aprilia RSV4 with the Brembo. So obviously we took like almost like 13 turns right now just to get to this bar. But here's the bike under some nice shade. The exhaust, you guys can see it again, Pro Race exhaust with some titanium. Um, I think there's a lot to it that we haven't even gotten close to. Um, of course, you know, I don't want to speed or anything like that. So we're driving uh, pretty calm. Sounds good. You know, you know, you can get a good thrill with just going slow. So, man, I love it. I don't even give a gas. It turns on like that automatically. Ain't that sound so good? Let's go. Hopefully that exhaust sound came out really good. crazy I think the front tire might need some air oh the floor is cracked I gotta go one more time around, dude. I gotta get cut through with this bike. Oh.
having trouble right there. There's the only one that is like really tight too. to talk bro this thing would just do the it would do it for itself like the uh the enthusiasm this thing screams enthusiasm this this thing screams the american dream bro this is happiness in two wheels guys literally um the looks, I love the looks on this bike. I think it's one of the sharpest bikes out there. When it comes, look at the rear, like the rear looks really sharp. So I love the rear end on this bike. Uh, one of the other bikes that is really aggressive is actually, in my opinion, the R6. I feel like the R6 back end is also very aggressive. The uh, BMW is also pretty aggressive. The Jigsaw, I feel like it's pretty aggressive too. But uh, yeah, I just like the way this bike has always looked. And uh, it rides good, it rode good. Uh, power wise it's fast but it's nothing where i'm like okay it's not jigs are fast you know it's not s1000 fast like that when they're tuned but i think it's still pretty fast so there's a lot to it but you know obviously i'm in the streets here so i'm not going to be pushing it or anything like that um if i was at the track it'll be completely different you know you can hit 200 miles per hour nobody's gonna tell you nothing so we kind of just rode to like the canyons so there was not many people and uh as much as we did i enjoyed it and i was pretty slow so it's good it's got a nice exhaust though that's one of the things that i fucking love about this bike man so next video i'm gonna do some stuff to it i'm gonna do some uh some like little things to it just to change it up make it look in my opinion a little better for my eyes but um nothing crazy but yeah some some stuff some wrap and some some stuff you know so hopefully in the next video i already finished it and uh it has the carbon fiber also on there so that's another thing i'm trying to do the carbon fiber on this bike so stay tuned guys